NATO has significantly underestimated Russia's capacity to replenish its armed forces with personnel and ammunition, a senior general said. Martin Harem, the commander of the Estonian Defence Forces, told Bloomberg that new intelligence on Russia's capabilities had sparked a reassessment in the military alliance, as well as a flurry of warnings to prepare for a protracted conflict. Contrary to earlier predictions, Russia can now produce several million artillery shells a year and recruit hundreds of thousands of soldiers, he said. A lot of people thought they couldn't go beyond that, today. The facts tell us otherwise, Harem told Bloomberg. He added, they can produce even more, many times more, ammunition. In July, Admiral Tony Radakin, the former head of the UK's armed forces, said that Russia could at best produce one million shells a year, per the Financial Times. The UK Ministry of Defence estimated in December that Russia could need up to 10 years to replenish its army. But that narrative has shifted over the past few months, with military commanders, analysts, and NATO officials warning of Russia's increasing capacities. In September, an unnamed Western official one of Russia's ability to make 2 million artillery shells a year. Per Reuters. And Christopher Cavalli, the commander of U.S. European Command, said in April that despite significant losses in Ukraine, Russia's ground forces were bigger than when it invaded Ukraine. Meanwhile, Republicans in Congress have stalled efforts to provide more aid to Ukraine, and the EU looks set to miss its target of sending 1 million rounds of ammunition to Ukraine by March. As a result, there are fewer supplies available on the front lines, and Ukrainian forces are being forced to reduce their combat activities. As recently as Tuesday, NATO Secretary General Jens Stoltenberg said the war in Ukraine had become a battle for ammunition. He called on Western allies to renew efforts to replenish Ukraine's stockpiles. In a group interview at the World Economic Forum in Davos, Switzerland, last week with news outlets including Business Insider. Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky said that a lack of Western assistance would result in a very large shortfall in air defense missiles, a lack of artillery, and a lot of deaths and injuries. Ukraine will struggle Ukraine will be weaker, and this will be an opportunity for Russia to invade us, Zelensky said, appearing to refer to a broader conquest of his country. He added, and as soon as they have invaded us, believe me, it will be a war between NATO and the Russian Federation.